In previous videos, we talked about NetApp Service Level Manager and its key role in delivering simple and consistent service experiences by enabling system environment to consume storage against certain performance level policies. As an industry movement, Ansible is becoming an increasingly popular tool for configuration management, provisioning, and application deployment tasks. In this video, I will demonstrate how to integrate NetApp Service Level Manager with Ansible and where you can find the related resources. From a bigger picture, Ansible users can download and utilize the SLM modules and sample playbooks to integrate SLM into their existing environment. The user requests will be generated as REST API calls to SLM, and the SLM instance will carry out corresponding operations to the connected ONTAP systems based on the user requests. SLM Ansible modules are posted on both the GitHub and NetApp Automation Store. You can download the corresponding version of Ansible modules matching the SLM version that you are using. Then unzip them. Transfer the modules and playbooks to your Ansible machine. It's not recommended to use the same VM for both SLM and Ansible uses. In my environment, I have created a separate VM as an Ansible server. We can now utilize these Ansible modules to integrate SLM into our existing playbooks or simply develop new playbooks. As an example, I will demonstrate how to provision a file share with the sample playbook that came with the download package. First, let's make sure we meet the prerequisites. We can refer to the steps listed in the README file to configure and prepare the environment. Then, let's modify a couple of sample playbooks. Let's open the nslm credentials.yml file and fill in the slm login information. In the nslm nfs share provision.yml file, you can specify the file share details. These are basically the file share API details that you can find in the slm API swagger page. After we are done, let's save the changes and the playbook will eventually call the corresponding module for the file share API call to slm. We can call the standard Ansible playbook command to execute the modified playbook. Once it's done provisioning successfully, we can go back to SLM or ONTAP to verify the file share creation. That's it! The Ansible module plugins will allow existing Ansible users to integrate SLM easily into their environment for ONTAP storage operations and management. Thanks for watching, and see you next time!